Oh. Of course, back to normal. See up there? Oh, man. What the, what the what? fuck? You're up in a tree. <laughs> top of a fucking tree! <laughs> okay. So it's good that he's covered in blood, right? Maybe. Blood. How the hell am I gonna get down? <laughs> Asked an answer. There's definitely a wolf there, isn't there? But he's on the island. Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the tree house. Where the hell are my clothes? Oh. We stole his clothes earlier. Yeah. You gotta be kidding me. He's gonna have to put girls' clothes on. Emma's. Because you didn't wear clothes. clothes. Oh, right. Apart from the hello. Then so what is he wearing? He's wearing yeah, Emma's wet clothes. clothes. No, because she. <laughs> no. Because the reason that she wore clothes was because she had left her She's clothes skinny. on the other island. So why is he wearing girl them. clothes? Why is he wearing yoga pants and the tight pink? Top with his midriff exposed. So this is going to awaken something in him. No, no. Anyone can wear. Uh, That's true. Hoodie. They're just like a bit small on him. They are a bit. Totally should have just gone to the Harbinger Motel. <laughs> it's going to be so awkward when they bump into each other, and she's wearing his clothes and he's wearing hers. Yeah, but after everything they've been through. No, the social <laughs> <laughs> Should we be filming it for the oh, YouTube? Oh god, and that goes everywhere. He goes oh. viral. Everyone's like, why are you such a judgmental bitch? What's wrong with the guy wearing these clothes? And it all turns on her. Right. Everyone mass and subs from her. The, yeah. Are I'm not even sure where we... You need to go. Yoga pant potato boy is probably gonna start trending. Because <laughs> he's not gonna be able to articulately explain what's going on, is he? No. He's not. There's the sharp. No, like, to why are you wearing our friend's clothes? It, it, it's heck? not. A, it's not a sex thing. Um, I, I didn't have my clothes. I'm wearing hers. Okay, potato boy. Uh, he's still got some blood on him, right? No, he kind of really oh. fucking cleaned up in that treehouse. Okay. Which may not have been... I guess it was just his blood. Was that... Does it count as werewolf blood or not? That's her cap, right? Yep, yeah, put it on, fuck it. Oh. That's Laura's. Yeah. <laughs> This is... Oh, is, is that like a hole for a ponytail? I guess. Why is there an extra hole? Oh. It kind of worries me that there's going to be like a moment of mistaken identity or, or something. What was safe, right? There's still the body in there. Yeah, but... Whose body was that? <sighs> we have no idea. It doesn't feel like we have a lot of options. There were... What? Okay. All right. Why were there so many warnings about, like, going in the water? 
when water is only harming werewolves. Yeah. It seems like kids, water very dangerous, water bad. Like, Even counsellors weren't allowed in the water. Yeah, it was like, don't jump in and save the kid, get a boat and pull them into the boat as fast as possible. Okay. Like, why was that? If, if you think water good, that scares off the wolves. What else could be in the water? Merman? Do you want to, should we just find Merman? I honestly don't care if this guy dies. <laughs> I didn't like him ever. Oh my god. Outside of the fact that he was very, very. Is, is this what you'd be like if you could play God? Would you just let people you don't like die? Yeah. My dear, sweet friend Tom. I've always liked you, Tom. <laughs> yeah? Well, I said how wonderful your, your fresh cut looks. You it does actually look great. You're amazing. You would have left me in that cage. Side, I would have, yes. But <laughs> that's, I'm not going to talk about me. You would have thought I was very handsome when you left me. Yes. Uh, what do you want to do? Stay on the island? What do we do if we stay on the island? Oh, we can zip by. Maybe. But maybe us spending too much time on the island would be bad. Yeah. Maybe we do need to swim and just see what happens. You can swim, right? <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> I hope the man gets us. Oh, it looks like a hat instantly. Okay. And my clothes are wet. Her clothes. That should sure be here. Handy. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> you. Okay. Just a little bit of a swim. Also, we know there isn't a wolf on here. Okay, it's about halfway to the bottom of this, right? Ish. Oh. There's just a werewolf waiting for it. Oh my god! <laughs> Insane shit. Are we just gonna leave it because it was funny? <laughs> like insane shit. I and I just called it like a moment before it happened. I mean, it's so it's such a perfect thing to have happened. Honestly, I'm fine with it. Yeah, I was gonna say it makes sense for us to stay on the island because they were gonna come and find it on the island. They're all in the fucking lodge, nice and safe in the warm, with that wonderful fire going and the rickety fireplace. Oh yeah. The table, help me. When we saw the car to the tower. There better be a payoff for that chimney. It's gonna it's gonna collapse. Okay. Well. Oh, no. no person it already is, right? Oh shit. Great. Oh you can still get sent to you. Just like the cartoons. <laughs> it's been off and on all night. Gives us a little time. How do you figure? They don't like water, remember? Right, right. Oh, we should have just been swimming in the lake all night. And die of hypothermia? No. Maybe that's all it is. Risk well, of hypothermia. We're good now. Or a boat. Night's not over yet. These there wasn't a merman. Just a werewolf from the dock. Great news, okay. Oh, I really want to a merman. We gotta get a vantage point. <laughs> Fuck. So what, we two down now? That guy doesn't fucking count. We're two down, but they were both jerks. Unlikable characters. And Tom's cool with that. Yeah, you know what? If you're a nice person, and I like you... You live. I'll save your life. But if I don't like you, Simon... What? Then you'll die on a whim. On a whim. A oh, whim. What the heck is this? Oh, wow. It's so much bigger than... I'm a happy, happy bunny. <sighs> that is going to fucking save our lives. Like, is that going to be a payoff? Because I would love that. This is Abby's bag. Yeah. Very nice. Little goth bag. That better... Better save us. <laughs> you 
pull the string and chuck it at a werewolf to, to distract it'll, it'll, it'll be a distractor. Maybe, maybe not. Fire extinguisher, very handy. I feel like this isn't home alone, Tom. We're setting up for a um, like the end of Until Dawn. What was that? What was the film? What's the ha what's the home invasion film that yeah, is the um, toxic masculinity one? Oh, Home Alone. But there is a moment with a fire extinguisher in it. Home Alone Two. And. It does just completely obliterate someone's head. I went through. Oh, it's paint can. Paint can. Better. Oh. Was that important that we found that? I guess we're like fortifying this place. Oh, no. Jeez, dude. Oh, was there a card in here that we never got? Yeah, it was on one of these pillar things, right? But. Yeah. Maybe it evaporates. Oh! Evaporated. Hey, old bear. Hello, bear. See, look, his head ain't all that big. Well, it's pretty big. It's big, it's big but tons. that skull. Easily. Easily this big. <laughs> Where's the card? What is that? What is their purpose right now? Cards? Do, do we actually know what they're doing? Us. All these Fortifying leftovers. Let's we'll see it earlier. Why is there like bits of spaghetti on all the plates? Yes. <laughs> well, these are going to leave all of that for the um, next... rest to clean up. Oh, I thought they were just going to wait till next summer. Oh, uh, gross. <laughs> uh, super not cool. Where is his office? Uh, we can find one quest. Let's find a vantage point, sure. Oh. Okay. It's not. Are they going upstairs? Yeah, the other staircase is open. I just mm. wanted to like make sure that there wasn't any other loop or like another window or something for us to go and fiddle with. Right. Yeah, but I, the the thing is, when you close that window, there wasn't like a path updated or anything. But it still feels like that was. I mean, they can just fucking smash through shit anyway. Yeah. They like, smash through all these windows. It did literally like punch through like the front of that crane. Yeah, I bet that was like plastic so they wouldn't like shatter in case a bit of metal flies at it. Yeah, but I feel like it just the metal gets lodged in it. Like and the whole this thing. This is gonna be like double glazing, this is just gonna be like plate glass. Which yeah. I think is a lot more fragile than Maybe they sprinkled silver. In, in the glass. How long has this guy been here? Oh. Sup, Jebediah? Jebediah. Is that actually Septimus? Septimus, the seventh son. Of the seventh son. Oh, is that how? Well, we, we know it's from the ago. White Wolf, the boy. Long enough ago that it was okay to have an oil painting made of yourself. Would you like an oil painting kind of of yourself? oil painting of me now. <laughs> Wait, there wasn't a Silas on that family tree, was there? Uh-oh. Oh. Okay, this just worries me. Maybe I should keep looking. So be a can we look at the family? Oh, we can't, can we? Because it was on the wall. I don't think we've got, like, a picture of it or anything. Hack your family tree. <laughs> I'm thinking Silas was an illegitimate child of one of the Hackett's, maybe. No, because they and were... And he's the secret werewolf. They were, king. um... Uh... Gin... Carnival folk. Gin runners. Carnival yeah, but I'm thinking the carnival folk. might have been oh. fed, visiting that area for generations. Uh, <laughs> oh, Septimus. okay, sure, yeah. You know... Because maybe that Silas has always been a boy. He doesn't age because he's a werewolf. Wolf boy. I don't know if that's how it could be. Poor Ian. Some camp mascot to kick it before camp starts. Oh. It was a sheep. In hindsight, sounds about right. 
Ian. We have a camp mascot? Well, no, we did. But you didn't hear? H hear what? He died before we got to camp. Uh-huh. Mm. Oh, yeah. Now, oh. now, Tom, where's she? Is it possible? She is it possible? Where's she? This whole time. Sheep wolf. How would it? How does the naming of it work? Well, it's still be a werewolf, right? Yeah. So when it's not a full moon, it's a sheep. Uh huh. It's minding its own business, and then full moon comes out. Sheep wolf. But it's not a humanoid. Yeah, so it's half sheep, half wolf. Yeah. Where have I seen this emblem before? It's got the jewelry. The crest of the hacket. Throwing off in a scruffle. <coughs> a scruffle. A scruffle. It's Bobby Hackett. Oh! So, oh, oh Bobby! Man. Oh, what God. Is it? A ring with the crest on it. Don't hurt him. Yes, oh, my child. Fancy. You can never pull it off. Wow. Oh, why don't you wear it then? And then she goes to put it on his stump. <laughs> <laughs> oh! I remember Mr. H's cheesy ass announcement. High pitch weird noises. Yeah. Oh. Perfect. Yes. Oh. Out battery. Careful with that. That's a camp relic. <laughs> Relax. It's dead anyway. Oh. R.I.P. Megaphone. I like how Dylan's still in good humor. Find some batteries, Tom. Battery? Battery box? What's this? Box full of batteries? Yeah. Trail VHS. Oh. It's like they're looking for something. Ooh. Yeah, uh, in Chris's surveillance room, he's storing all the footage. I think you might be right. Evidence? Bingo. Okay. The evidence being a picture of the VHS <laughs> tape. Okay. <laughs> that says, you know, mm. spooky goings on. Silver lined mirror. Good. Very good. And megaphone. This seems like a good place to be. Yeah, but the megaphone's dead. Yeah, but you might get a single <laughs> out of it. And that might be enough. The, the mirror is not broken. It's kind of cracks. The pair of cracks from side to side. Maybe we could use the broken megaphone. Oh, awful. Awful, um, Agatha Christie. Jesus. Uh, the cracks mirror. Okay, I kind of think we've kind of done all the exploring we can. Nice picture. Aww. Is that the young Lance Henriksen? Oh. Yeah, that? that's Constance. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see that. I wish I could remember the name of the actress. She was in Ouija. Ouija? I never saw her. Oh, not very good. good. It's very teen. The start is fantastic. There's like a couple of twists in it that are really good. It's not a bad film. Jeez, I'm see really struggling if they're begging for a dollar. Ozaki is asking Kemp's parents for additional donations to help with the lodge's renovation cost. Uh, for the trail cams and stuff, all the things needed repairing and stuff, right? Okay. And I guess the, um... Well, I don't know if it was him to spend the money, the five grand on the... Electro cages. Yeah. That's pretty expensive, isn't it, actually? Five grand. Oh. Mm, nice rock. <gasps> Dog tags. Nice to put a name to a big mean face. So what, you're like Mr. H's brother, I guess? Wolf tags? The big dude from earlier. When you and Ryan went to the What evidence to pin it all on the hunters? 
brother? Maybe. Right, right. Got these crazy ass. Oh, just chuck it on the fucking floor, whatever. Sure, yeah. Okay. So far, nothing has been very useful. <sighs> Not really. A mirror and a megaphone with no batteries. Wait, is this the same? Oh my god. You did it, Tom. I've done it. You fucking did it. Those ball tingles. They work for now. Do you get you get them before you find a card? Mm -hmm. And then after. Mm -hmm. A stronger one after. In fact, you know what? They, they, they just actually just never stop. Oh god. I think we've seen everything now. We found the high priestess. Uh which seems pretty good. Even Dylan's like, come on, let's go downstairs. Yeah, come on, let's stand in front of the painting and press A. Is there gonna be a, is there a big finale invasion? Oh. Do you think everyone would have to be together? For that. There's only one. But well, now, right? The white. Did we, did, is Nick dead? That's the time. <sighs> no, Nick should be fine. Should oh. If the white wolf. Every dusk and dawn all through the summer. The son the Caleb is still a wolf because he built. Lead the way. Shit, it's yeah. For proud to say. <laughs> shout at Stratton, shout out loud. We're hacketeers. Two months and you never learn the words? <sighs> I guess now we find out that. No. No way. They're not gonna come in. Showtime, motherfuckers. They're coming in through the fucking chimney, Tom. What? Why? <laughs> because they don't want to get cut by the glass. Keep it together. Not long till morning. Oh. <gasps> what was that? Also well, interesting that this kept power the whole time. <laughs> what the fuck? Didn't think to the shoot there. I feel like I would panic shot if that was me. Don't. Don't what? <laughs> Don't shoot. Well, oh, wait. What? I would wait and just line up a shot, right? Yeah? Oh, fuck, he's following me. Oh, 
that down. Ooh. Nice. Well, we're really going to jump and climb pretty good. Yeah, but they're balanced. Not so good. Balance bad. Yeah, fuck. I don't run. <sighs> Arbitrary decisions. Caitlin, this way. Huh. Okay. It's good that they're together, right? Yeah, I feel stronger. Okay, go, go. Caitlin, you don't have time for that, come on. Yes, you have to. Go to work me. I don't know if we should, because then we want to save the silver bullet for the king. The white wolf. Oh my god, the rabbit is in here, right? Investigate or run? Abby? I feel like run. <sighs> okay. A bit more who you want to save. If you don't want any lives, then you should use the life, and then we won't have any lives. And then, <laughs> but then Dylan might die. Well, and I've really warmed up to him ever since he stayed positive with his stump. Positive mental stump attitude. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what well, do it go into the freezer? We might want to trap it in the freezer. How is Dylan going to survive this? Exactly. I think if we if we use it now. We might save Dylan later. Okay. Really? You're gonna have to do the breathing again. Oh, it's breathing challenges. Very easy. They don't seem the most taxing. Okay. Fuck <laughs> oh, this one up. Okay. I like the, I like the, the wolf face. They're just weird enough. It's only slightly wolfy. Yeah. Wrong, wrong, <laughs> bing, wrong. Okay. Okay, freezer. So you might have to quick time this. Freezer. Use decoy. Oh, the rabbit! Nice. Oh, that's teamwork. That's fucking teamwork. That's fucking team. Oh my god, I knew this would pay off. Yeah. You play with me! She's locking it in the front. Yeah. Oh, the balls are heavy now! Oh. 
fucking hell, Tom. I only did it to save Dylan. Yeah. <laughs> also, now we still have the silver bullet for the white wolf. Oh my god. Because we have to cut it off at the source. Oh my god. You got no lives, by the way. That's fine. Zero lives. Where are we going? We don't need lives. Hit the fuck? Hello? Is this the car? Oh, is this our... Is this Ted Raimi? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, Sam. <laughs> Jim. Jim Raimi. Jim Raimi. Jeff Raimi. Yes? Raimi. Yes? Hello, it's me, Jeff Raimi. Inquisitive. What exactly happened six years ago? Yeah. So what exactly happened six years ago? There was a fire that wiped out dozens of people, and now there's werewolves yeah. and ask a you, ghost that I? roams ask the, the woods you looking might for a lost baby boy. Yeah. Which I've just put together is Silas. Oh shit. It's a long story. No, it's not. There was a fire. Silas, the wolf boy, escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. Burn. <sighs> what happened in the past doesn't matter right now. Well... Uh, it kind of does, actually. We need to know what we're up against, at least. A little boy! What we're up against is a feral boy turned werewolf for the last six years has avoided being found. No matter what we did. Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single so one. Why did look? The other 97 days. The is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for a So how do you even know where he is? How the hell are we going to find him just driving down the oh middle of the Oh my god. <laughs> That's a good moment. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Good. Reflex. <laughs> Jesus, take the wheel! Wait, take the gun? You saw I feel like the wheel might be the good one to take, actually. Travis! Travis, get it together, come on! Uh, I got it! I got it! Just get down! Brace, brace right back. I hope everyone's got the seatbelt on. <laughs> oh, run them over like Jeepers Creepers. Oof. Go! Lord! Yeah! Where did he go? Oh, he just disappeared. Fuck. <laughs> He's gotta be nearby. Oh. Let's get out of the car. No, come on. Let's go out the car. Are you crazy? Run! Come on, Come take on. out Ted immediately. No? How's um, Ryan doing? Ryan? Ryan? You got some red. Nice. You're okay. Ryan? I'm better, but yeah. Was he a wolfman long enough to get enough blood back? Over here. Got some blood. This doesn't feel... This doesn't seem like the right plan. <laughs> no. At least he's not under the car, right? Oh, that'd there. be good. What the hell happened back here? Whoa. This is, is where we left the road two months ago. Oh! You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. Go ahead. If that's what you want, I won't stop you. What? Okay. Normally? I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high risk. We could be killed. You ready to end this? Let's, Let's fucking do this. What's 
fucking do this. I like it, like the red light, uh, that, was, that was a nice shot. It's a nice moment, the unlikely uh, heroes together. I thought they began to like the scene of the fire. Yeah. Oh, where they went off the road. Yeah, it's not like that would make sense. But I guess it's sort of a, a book ending. This is where it all started. For her, anyway. It's very wet. Damn, this place has got some. Why well, is it raining all the Didn't do it justice. You don't know what happened. This is where I saw her. The witch. I thought she was. I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The woman. The old woman. She was saying something over and over again. Silas. Oh my God, she was saying Silas. Silas. I saw her too, in the run tunnels. Silas. Oh, we've got a name. Silas's his mother. I think. Who was she? She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Called him Silas the Wolf <laughs> Boy. It's kind of fucked, isn't it? Died in a fire. Some say she never left. <gasps> the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Maybe she's not a ghost. Silas ever since. Maybe she's just a person. Maybe. It's just the teleports. And he's invisible. Oh my god. Really? You're still hiding stuff now? <laughs> yeah, come on, dude. We'd like team enough. I blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hackett. One of the kindest, gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. And all she wanted to do was help that little boy. Locked in a cage by that freak show witch. Yeah, we, what is she here doing? we go. She just wanted to help him. Travis. She convinced Caleb to start a fire. It was just a distraction. What? Just a little fire. Just a little fire. Give him enough time to get Silas out of his cage and give him his freedom. That's not what happened. No. Because within minutes, everybody was dead. Oof. Mercy Hayburn, Liza, whole crew. Kaylee managed to get Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. Oof. In hindsight, uh, releasing the werewolf boy was a bad decision. But I guess, like, you didn't realize he was a real werewolf boy. Just thought he was a hairy little boy. Yeah. Just a hairy little albino. The hairy boy. boy. Hunting him. Silas, I mean. Every full moon for six fucking years. Once yeah. again, why don't they so just grab him his boy? 80 fucking formulas ish. 80. That's it. And they have managed to do it. Left. Unless Jesus they didn't Christ. give up. They never well, gave up. We are at the, the place. Holy shit. Any sign? Negative. Damn, I never saw any of this. I didn't even know this was here. Maybe don't wander off by yourself, mate. Don't just... Okay. Unannounced, just wander off. Into the dark. Yeah. Great. Great decision. Oh. Shit. I'm sorry, that was... Close. We must be close. Oh, fuck. Did you both see it too? Kind of wish I hadn't. She hey. looked green. Like the shining bath woman. Shining. Oh, yeah. Sorry, so You've you seen know, the shining. The shining bath woman. Oh, right. Wait, who's what? You what thought, shining bath woman? You pictured a woman coming out of a bath just slick. Oh, it's a dog boy. I thought it was just something else. You were like, oh. Oh, we're going to tingle again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Must be a card nearby. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. 
Oh my god, if we see a card right now. <laughs> it'll, be, it'll be perfect. Come on. Come on, game. Oh! I, I want the Goodbye. white wolf. Wait. Does the white wolf look different? <laughs> Doesn't seem to. We've not seen a lot of. Oh! Uh, um. Fucking Jesus Christ. My god. Which is not going to be happy. No. What's wrong? What are you waiting for? Shoot, you stupid girl! We're going to have to shoot it. We're going to have to shoot it. Wait, do we raise gun? To shoot? Fuck. But I think the witch will come and interfere. Are you sure about this? Shoot. My boy. Fuck yeah. No. Sorry, witch. He's a werewolf. They're killing people. Please, <gasps> this is, this what is was that little fucking look for? Curse has like been hanging over his family. His, his nephew is going to be alive. That was relief. That was... It did look a bit sus, but... That's sus AF. He's been sus the whole time. I think it's just... He just looks suspicious. It's just his face. Okay. The White Wolf. Got some chief. Oh. Uh oh. Um... I bet you think you have it all figured out. I bet you think you're fucking clever. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. I even started to like you. Oh. Not now. Not after this. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. What? I've what? been with what? you all night. Well, well, I'm not about to stop hot. now just because it's the hot. night's come to an end. You no. push the button. Whenever you hear a noise in the dark, a whisper, <laughs> shadows, the breath on the back of your neck that tickle your balls. That'll be me tickling your balls. I will never leave you. Well, just think about all those kids at the camp that won't be killed. Yeah. <sighs> now, have we got enough evidence to not all go to prison? That's... We do have a living <laughs> cop with us. That's true. Hi guys! Sweet Jess! <laughs> yeah. Jess is alive somewhere, isn't she? Welcome to my channel! I do beauty, I do travel, I do unboxing videos! You all three at once! Sees Bob was born to death by his well brother. <laughs> Jed massacred by his well old son. Can a single person be massacred? Chris Hackett. Was killed with his face. Oh, oh. Something with silver. Oh, God. Uh, Laura Constance's face. <sighs> shot. Laura shot Constance's face off. Ow, oh, fuck, Jacob. Rip in peace, Jacob. <laughs> Rip in peace. <laughs> that was. Kaylee. That was our fault. No, we didn't have any control over that. Yeah. Emma, alive? Because we killed, um, because she was in the Nick alive. Oh man. Max fucking dead. <laughs> that was funny though. That was funny. <laughs> Just... Abby alive. Uh... Caitlin alive. The, the toy rabbit. The rabbit toy was so funny. Dylan. Uh, 
People. I thought that was going to be a bigger thing, um, but no. Maybe it was never werewolves, it was just the loose mutants. Yeah, like um, M. M Night Shaolin... The Village. The Village. Spoiler. Spoiler alert. <laughs> yeah. Mm. But yeah. Uh, it's okay, pacing's off in places. Really off. The flashback scene slowed things down. Yeah. It was like, you know, it was good for making you actually care about Laura. Laura. Um, Maybe not potatoes so much. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same dying on yeah. a dog. Just knowing that he would die. That was but... funny. We needed that extra life though. So but Yeah, there was no way I was going to save him. But I wanted to go in the water because I wanted to see if a merman would pop out. What was up in the water <laughs> down there? <sighs> I what guess a werewolf happening? just died in the water trying to escape the island. It oh. turned into a human, so there's a human corpse down there, because he used to be a werewolf. Okay, sure. It's probably all it is. So you kind of kind of like it? Yeah, I think so. It's, it's a fun experience, the interactive horror movie thing. It was good enough. It was good enough. I don't know. I mean, House of Ashes really did blow my mind, and the pacing was a lot quicker. There's a lot more going on. A lot tighter. So much going on. With this, it was just like, oh, it's just the thing. Sure, there's a ghost of a witch. And sure, it turned out that she didn't actually want her son, who was the werewolf, to be killed. She was responsible for the whole thing. She just wanted the hunters dead. Yeah. Well, I guess the hunters <sighs> killed her? And her uh, carnival. How did she die in the end? <laughs> she walked into the fire and exploded? Question mark. <laughs> I don't know. That's not entirely clear. Mm. Maybe she isn't a ghost. Maybe she's just a person. Maybe she got magical powers. Like that whole anything. thing was a bit. I don't. I don't really understand. I'm not gonna lie. What what she was about at the end? Because. It could just be purely scientific with the werewolves, right? A bloodborne disease kind of thing. Pathogen. You know, proteins in saliva, passing it on through by Lula based. You know, sure. The moon thing is a bit weird. Oh, but silver killing? Well, I mean, that could just be a chemical reaction. That's fair enough. That's not insane. Okay. 
But the ghost, harder to scientifically explain where the ghost is. Saliva. Saliva ghost. Oh, yeah. Maybe that's all it, that's all it is. Proteins in saliva <laughs> causing you to uh, hear and see a ghost. Yeah, sometimes. something like something like that. But I, I don't know. Maybe it's nice to have a mix of the supernatural and the more explainable. The tangible. Physical. I don't know. I think it could have gone a bit wilder, maybe. Yeah. When when that we were going into like chapter seven or eight, I was like, okay, we know it's werewolves. Now, blow my mind. Like now, give me the yeah, give me the something else. But I think the something else was literally just like, Ghost Cyrus was the white wolf. Yeah, yeah. At least they did give us that um, sort of narrative twist. I was like, okay. but it wasn't a mind blowing. Yeah. It was more like, oh, okay. The wolf boy, sure. Yeah, because when they were talking like, <laughs> oh, we've got to like, Laura was like, we've got to kill Chris Hacker to kill our guy. Imagine if we knew that there was a wolf boy right from the start. It would be fun. <laughs> we would be talking. We would be talking about boy a lot. A little wolfy boy. Yeah, like wolf boy at the circus. Yeah. Um, yeah. Would be very, very into that. I really like the characters in this. I think. Yeah. Even the annoying characters. I don't know. They were I, fun. I liked how... At the start in particular. Snappier it was written. The dialogue was goofy as heck, but yeah. it made me laugh a lot. And... The back and forth, the banter. I, was I great. could remember which character was kind of which character, although I could yeah. their names endlessly, compared to a lot of the other games. True. Generally, I instantly forget who was who and what each person's motive was. Yeah. Um, but in this... Well developed characters. Yeah. That we mostly liked, but it's okay to not like them all. Because by not liking them, at least they've shown you enough of their personality for you to go, I don't mind if this asshole dies. Yeah. Rather than just being, who is this guy? Yeah, yeah. Um, that was fun. It felt a little, a little derivative of Until Dawn with the werewolves. Yeah, a lot of similar s- skinny uh, creature jumping at you. Yeah, and like having to do a reaction remind me so much of the Wendigo. Like the werewolves of the Wendigo feel so interchangeable. The don't breathe was the same as just com- completely still. Yeah, I kind of preferred. I didn't like that complete, sick, completely still mechanic. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I, I think it was pretty good. It was pretty good. It's so weird that there's the whole like, what is the look? What is the bootlegging thing got to do with anything? I don't know. Like, I th- I really thought that we were gonna blow, <laughs> blow up the house or something like that. They got this rum. Mm, evidence rum. It's like okay. No idea. I, but I wonder how but, uh, different stuff could have gone. Maybe. Maybe they just needed a good explanation for why there was like a tunnel system. What was supposed to do the quarry? The house was built by. Houses in New York, all built with the quartzite from the quarry. The family got rich and then started doing rum for reasons. Weird, weird little, I mean, maybe, you know, fleshed out the history of the family. Yeah. But it didn't quite, didn't feel like it, me- it meant anything. It just details me feel sick. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'll give it a seven out of ten. Seven out of ten. I think seven point five, maybe eight. God, actually, I enjoyed it. Like the story was kind of lacking a bit here and there, mm. but it was fun. I definitely enjoyed playing it. I felt like this was so much better. I think I prefer this to House of Ashes. Really. I think just, it, I like how goofy and horror movie it is. Yeah. Uh, like, it just, you constantly are reminded of classic horror films as you're playing it and just kind of... So a lot of it not so. Yeah, and but I, I appreciate, I like how just in your face it is. Yeah. And that it is just doing the tropes. You know, you do a, it's just like a, you know, it's a fun kind of meta-esque piece of it. Yeah. Enjoyable. I mean, having like, the, the trap door under the rug. Amazing. <laughs> like, the secret door, like, so many scenes in that that just 
feel like they just look lifted directly from silly horror movies. Yeah. Real big fan. Good times. Good times. Fun. 7.5 I think it's fair. It's yeah, a fair score. 7.5. Cool. It's a fair score. So. Man. Well. I had a blast Tom. I had an absolute blast. Me too buddy. Thank you for bringing me here. Oh, like flinching as you... <laughs> Is that the witch? It's the witch. She's never going to leave us. She's with you. She's with you from now on. Yeah. Well, we'll never be lonely. That's true. With a witch ghost. Yeah. An angry witch ghost. Tingling your balls. Oh, God. Maybe that's where the tingle always came from. The witch all along. <gasps> Maybe the real tingle was the witch haunting us all along. And on that note, see you next time. Boop.